What's up Puma Nation? Welcome back to the channel and uh, the time has come for a reveal of the home office that I've been working on. If you've been following me on Twitter, follow me on Instagram, you know um, I haven't been recording a lot just because I've been trying to get this home office completed. We uh, actually took a section of the kids playroom. See this giant disaster of a mess every time we clean it up the the boy comes in and tears it up. We built this entire wall we built a chalkboard wall. We just painted chalkboard for the kids on that side. You can see they've uh, taken full advantage of that, that's for sure. But behind this pocket door, behind this sliding door, is the creme de la creme. Guys, this, I, I'm so pumped. I finally have my own space. I'm a grown man, for crying out loud. Um, and I've been doing stuff in the living room at our old house, but in this new house, we found the space we wanted and was eight when we were able to take a section and build a friggin wall and make an office build an office so here we go we're gonna slide the door back and bam check it out we got the WCW World Heavyweight Championship and if the audio is a little off I'm sorry I'm recording this on my iPhone um, got the pops got some autographs got some Macho Man stuff some DVDs all the gaming systems set up all the games Got everything going on here, but we're gonna go over everything one at a time. So here we go. We got the World Heavyweight Championship, WCW World Heavyweight Championship, not the WWE version. Uh, I was a WCW guy for a long time, probably about 1998. I moved over to WWF, but still continue to watch. But we got the WCW Championship. We got Booker T, the five-time WCW champion. Kurt Angle actually held this title also for about a minute before Booker took it from him. And then we got the Nature Boy, Ric Flair, 16-time World Heavyweight Champion on that side. So we got that mounted up there above the closet. In the closet, we got this little storage system. Got my old camcorder in there. The old Elgato with just some certain, just junk, really. We got all of these Super Nintendo things. Regular Nintendo. Got the Game Genie, of course. Got the Nintendo Gun. This binder here has, well, first of all, that is signed by Kevin Nash. I need to find a place. Just haven't found a place for that yet. We got Rhino. We got the Young Bucks, Sergeant Slaughter. So a lot of these came um, in, there's Kurt Angle. A lot of these came in the Wrestle Crate, Johnny Mundo, Booker T autograph stuff, Kevin Nash, DDP when I met him. The Harlem Heat when I met them. So some of those are gain or were acquired by myself. Some of them were acquired by WrestleCrate. So here we go. Let's get into these pictures. We got Always Believe, the Ultimate Warrior, right here. Uh, this one and the Macho Man one down there I got for Christmas one year. Hogan, Hokamania, got a big red and yellow sign right there. This one I'm very excited about. I met Bret Hart at Booker T's Reality of Wrestling. Here in Houston, got him to sign it. He had never seen a shirt like that, he said. Brett the Hitman Hart right there is and was and ever will be. Then, of course, the Macho Man, Randy Savage. Got the autograph right there. So we got the wall O autographs right there. That's my, my pride and joy of this room. So we come back over this way. Look at all these Pop Funkos, man. Holy Toledo. Now I'm missing some. There's actually four John Cena's, which I don't have two of them. They're really hard to get. I don't have the uh, CM Punk's, the AJ Lee, um, a couple of the Daniel Bryan's and the Rey Mysterio's. They're really hard to find, and they're hella expensive on eBay. Same with the alternate Hogan and Macho Man. But let's take a look here. We got Rey Mysterio came to Booker T's Reality of Wrestling. Got that autograph. That's in a protector. We got the Hollywood Hogan that came in 2K15. The Bella Twins, the Nature Boy. Red and Black Sting with an autographed black and white Sting right there. The white and black Seth Rollins. I got two Roman Reigns. One I bought, one came in a wrestle crate. And if you look, I'm not sure if that makes a difference, but he's kind of got a beard on that one and not on that one. I don't know if that makes it special or not, but I kept it. We got all the New Day and their white outfits. Shawn Michaels, Finn Balor, Kane. Uh, starting with Shawn Michaels, this is the new release. I got another Finn Balor coming uh, pretty soon, so that's going to go in that empty spot. McFoley, Goldberg, AJ Styles. 
We got the Demon Finn Balor. Chris Jericho, Bailey. There's another Chris Jericho. I got a Sasha Banks coming. I got Iron Sheik and Ted DiBiase coming. And actually a special edition Finn Balor. We got the two packs. Big Cass and Enzo, even though they just broke up. Two versions of the New Day. One, they're just the New Day. The second one, they got those bootios. Yep. Red and black Bella Twins right there. We're going to step back over here. Got the Macho Man Collector's Edition with the glasses. Nothing yet in some of these shells, but we'll get there. Moving along to the top here. We've got the Ninja Turtles 1980s whole collection. Man, I grew up on that. My other obsession besides wrestling is these different movies up here. Look at this. Who is this? That's Steven Seagal, man. I love Steven Seagal movies. I have just about all of them. I'm missing about 13 or so. We got Star Wars, Indiana Jones, The Shield, Pirates of the Caribbean. Down here, we got a Stone Cold DVD, Paul Heyman, Two Macho Mans, Ladder Match 1 and 2, Attitude Era 1 and 2, Hard, the uh, History of the Hardcore title. I actually haven't watched that one yet, but I am looking forward to that. And then a mixture of Blu-rays. Coming over here is the setup. This is the setup, kids. So we got the PS1 right here. PS2, got a little Finn Balor action. PS3, this one came um, in last year's um, NXT edition. Look at that belt. Focus, uh, look at that belt. How old is that belt? Man, that's an old WCW belt. We got the PS4 and the Xbox One. Different controllers sitting out. Uh, the 2K15 piece of history that came with the game. There's that's there. We've got a mixture of PS3 and PS4 games. A couple of Xbox One games. I haven't had my Xbox One that long. So I don't have too many games. A couple of them... Excuse me. Jeez, I burped. A couple of them I have uh, on the hard drive. And then we've got Lita autograph thing there. When she came to Booker T's Reality Wrestling. That's where I meet a lot of these wrestlers. It's down here in Houston. But if you've been following me on Twitter and Instagram, you know what this is. This is every, every American released wrestling game for the PlayStation, all the way from one to four. Look at this stuff, man. WrestleMania, the arcade game. First one, right there. We got In Your House. We got Power Move Pro Wrestling. I don't even know what that is, but I bought it because it's wrestling. This game right here holds a special place in my heart. That game, I remember when I was little, my mom had to put that thing on layaway at Walmart. 40 bucks or 30 bucks back in the day was a lot uh, for a single mom. And that was like the very first wrestling game I ever got. So mom got me that on layaway. We've got all of these going all the way up to Backstage Assault. Nobody has these games. They're junk. All the PS2 games, uh, even Crush Hour. Who has Crush Hour? We got Rumble Roses in there. We got Showdown Legends of Wrestling. Um, both Backyard Wrestling games right here. Uh, where's the first one? Don't try this at home. Backyard Wrestling 2. Some Rumble Roses. Fire Pro Wrestling Returns. We got a lot of stuff. TNA Impact and then into the PS3 games. Um, we got the, the ones everyone knows about. We got this AAA, uh, Lucha Libre. And then WWE 12 up to 2K17. Moving down to the setup here, representing H-Town. We got some PS1 on the monitor there. So I have this little, this little remote and this little box. Everything is hooked up to that box. All of these systems are hooked up to that box. So if I want to play PS1, I hit the number one. Look at that. We got Red and Black Sting playing some... Uh, WCW NWO Thunder right there. Goldberg versus Sting. Let's see how this looks. Now, if you know, I mean, this is on PS1, so yikes. Let's see. It looks like it's loading up here. Look at this. Now, this, I mean, this one it was like you got two or three, four or five moves, something like that, and you just mash those buttons pretty much. Goldberg not making it off the top. So if I want to play a little PS2, I just come up with the remote, bam, hit the two. Coming up is that PS2. We got some Here Comes the Pain playing on the old old PS2. 
So I, if you guys want to see any of these videos or any of these games, just holler. I will make some videos on these games. Hit the button for the PS3. And on the PS3, we're running some WCW All-Stars right now. All these systems are running for you, folks. This junk is for you. We go to PS4. What are we running on PS4? Of course, WWE 2K17. That's right. Chris Jericho right there. And then number five is the Xbox One. And that is also loaded up on 2K17 with the Universe Mode SWF, Southern Wrestling Federation. Let's see, we can't wake it up. There we go. Um, Rick Andrews is our current champion. We've got a new show coming, SWF Rebellion. So that's coming up soon. Then I've got the mic. Bam. Drop the mic down, do some recording, get some stuff done. So, guys, I've I've been waiting a long time for this. Um, the setup is just perfect. We pretty much built this whole desk setup and all these shelves for all this stuff around that, around my gaming systems. Um, I, mean, I wanted to make sure everything had a place. So, everything definitely does have a place, and I am pumped about it. And I hope you guys are too, because that means... We can probably start getting in here, getting some more videos done. So that's going to be it for this video. If you saw any of these wrestling games over here you want to see videos of, guys, I'll make videos of all of them if you want. Holler at me. Let me know. We will get them done. So that's going to be it, guys. Thank you for watching. I am CM Puma. You're welcome, and peace out.